Mount Gambier with the turnover, and Eltham were able to leak out. It was a nice find by Mailey to Liddell in the corner for the three. So we see Rinal there with the mid-range jumper on the wing. Mount Gambier come up with another stop there, and it's a good child out on the fast break. Finds Branca Tassano in the corner for three. And drains it. Mount Gambier take a three-point lead, and Eltham need a timeout. Liddell comes across. Rinal tosses up the mid-range jumper. Falling down, they come up with the offensive rebound. It's a good one. Good child for three. She's drilled a couple in a row. 12 points. And couldn't come up with a score, so down the floor we go. Can they come up with another final score in the dying seconds? Foul called! Looking to crawl back slightly on this margin that Mount Gambier are able to string together in the last few minutes of that first quarter. The shot goes up and it's drilled by Sherry Kalia. Paint collides with Maley and comes out through the hands of Kalia. Looking inside here is Rinal. Comes across with Ali Marshall, and here's another three point play for Haley Rinal. Want to stay healthy, and if this game does get out of hand any further for Eltham, might see both teams pull their stars. It's a nice. Here's Branca Asado. Munro comes to help. They double briefly. Rinal considers her option, then was left alone and steps into the three. The three Carly Trists had no interest in hearing her out on that one. Here's Kalia, receives it again and win considered the uh, intercept but couldn't quite get there. Rinal pulls up at the free throw line and nails it for two points. So I think that they've got another gear to go. I, I suspect they're only in second gear on, on today's performance as Rinal makes her way down the floor and finishes over the defensive hands for two.